Hello viewers, welcome to the channel Amazing Civil Engineering Studies. In today's video we are going to discuss about, what is stub column. In this video, we explained what is stub column, why stub column used in building construction, what is the purpose of stub column and so more. What is stub column? Stub column is defined as a type of column that is not directly connected with footing, constructed over the beam or slab to transfer the load on the primary beam. Stub column is a non-structural type of column and the height of stub column is very less. The stub column does not have any footing or pedestal like a gonaral column. Because it's start or you can say it is constructed over the beam or slab to carry the extra load that is x over it. The stub column act on primary beam as a point load. What is the purpose of stub column? Generally, a stub column is provided to increase the stiffness of buildings. Stub column is used to transfer the load from one beam to another beam. The stiffness of a structure is the ability of a building to resist deformation. It is a one type of redundant compression member. When stub column used. Stub column is used as per the architectural point of view. It is used to increase the aesthetic view of building. Stub column is used when the length of the beam increases. Because the length of the beam or other structural elements will be within the deflection limit as per the Indian standard provision. But in case the length of the beam will increase for any causes, stub columns are used to reduce the deflection of the beam and the Indian standard criteria can also be satisfied. It is also used when the extra construction happens in the building which is not taken into consideration while designing of building. So to carry the load of this extra construction, stub columns are provided in the building. When the water tank is constructed in a building for only 70 peoples, but in case more than 70 peoples are come into the building or lives in the building, it is necessary to construct an extra water tank to fulfill the water requirement of peoples. In this condition, the stub columns are provided below the extra water tank to carry the load of the tank and safely transport the load on the primary beam. Difference between stub column and floating column Stub column Floating column Stub column is a column that is not directly connected with the footing and constructed between only one floor. Floating column is a column that is not directly connected with footing and constructed on a building more than one floors. Length is very less. Length is more. Stub columns start and end between one floor. Floating columns start from one floor and go up to the height of the building that is up to the top floor of the building. Stub column rested on a beam or slab. Floating column rested on a primary beam or slab. 
Stub column acts as a point load on the beam. Floating column also acts as a point load on the beam. Thanks for watching. For now, please subscribe, like, share and do not forget to press bell icon.